Hello everyone, welcome to Toti Toot. In this session, we will see the syllabus of electrical engineering and similarly electronics engineering and how to prepare for GATE exam 2023. Okay, so let's see the syllabus first. Okay, so, so what is the syllabus? So if you take the electrical engineering, so total this many subjects will be there. Okay, so and if you take the electronics, so these subjects will be there. And what is the similarity between electrical and electronics means there are similar subjects you see from here to here. Okay, so coming from the mathematics, quantitative aptitude, circuits. Okay, so for electronics, it will be networks, but syllabus will be the same only. Okay, control systems, signals and systems, analog electronics, digital electronics. Okay, and not only common subjects, these are okay. So, for either you are from electrical background or electronics background, okay, so these are the common subjects you will be preparing. So, why these common subjects are important means, so the major portion of our marks will be depends upon these things only, okay. So just observe what, how much marks they are giving. So, from the electrical circuits, control system, signals and systems, from these only, you will get around 30 marks, okay. So, 30 marks means it is not less number, okay. So, with 30 marks, you can directly get the qualification. Okay, so not only from electrical, even from the electronics also. Okay, analog and digital electronics. Okay, for for the electrical branch, it will carry around 10 to 15 marks. Okay, so minimum of 10 and maximum of 15. For electronics, okay, so it will carry total of okay, so 12 to 16 or 17 marks. Okay, minimum of 12. These two subjects. Okay, analog electronics plus digital electronics. And electrical, they will be having so EMF and electronics will be having EMTL. Okay, so almost same will be there for the syllabus half of the syllabus will be same for the electrical and electronics okay and coming to the core part okay so what are the core part for the electronics communications and edc okay similarly for the electrical branch okay so core part will be power systems machines measurements and power electronics okay so remaining all the portions all the remaining marks will be coming from this okay and remember one thing the mathematics part okay so mathematics part is so important because so mathematics plus quantitative aptitude will carry total of 30 marks both for electrical and electronics or any branch okay so it is the common one so total you will get around 30 marks from this one or little bit one or two marks so more also you may it may be possible okay so you can see one thing so this come if you see the syllabus okay first you need to prepare these subjects okay so first you have to complete these subjects and daily you have to complete this mathematics and quantitative aptitude okay so then you will be able to get more than 60 marks definitely okay so and definitely you have to prepare these subjects also so these are the core subjects so first you complete these subjects then you coming to these subjects okay so let's see the so pattern of the exam and all these okay so total 60 total we have 65 questions in gate exam okay in 65 questions 30 questions are one mark questions and 35 questions are two marks questions okay so remember there will be negative marking also okay so 30 30 questions and these 35 questions in all these there are three types of questions one is multiple choice questions okay so multiple choice questions you will be knowing easily okay so four options will be there from those four options you have to choose only one option okay so second type is a numerical answer type questions okay so numerical answer type question so there will be fill in the blank okay fill in the blank that will be only numerical type of question okay so you have to fill the blank correctly okay and third type of questions are multiple select questions Okay, multiple select questions. Okay, multiple select questions means in the given four options, there may be more than one option correct. So, we have to choose two options or three options or four options also if possible. Okay, so if only one option is correct in the remaining, so you can choose only one option. Otherwise, how many questions, how many answers are correct, how many options are correct in that one, all the things we have to select. Okay, so anyway, in detail, you will be knowing about these things in a different video. Okay, and what is the qualification? If you take electronic electrical or electronics almost okay so the qualification mark for the oc candidates it will be so 30 marks around okay so if the question paper is little bit easier it will go to 32 or 33 if the question paper is a little bit difficult okay so it will go to 25 to 27 around it will come okay so remember you have to get at least 30 marks to get the qualification okay so but why we are writing the gate so in order to get into iits Okay, in order to get into IITs or NITs or we want to get into the PSUs, okay. So, that is the main aim, right, okay. So, to get into these things, okay, so what you have to do is you have to get a rank below 1000 definitely, 
okay so less than 1000 you have to get okay so less than 1000 means how many marks you have to get means that depends on the question paper okay so sometimes for a 55 marks only in the ece last year okay like 2022 you got for the 55 marks only you got the selection for the interviews in psus okay so or you can write the some other exams also based on gate exam okay so that means some years it will be 55 to 60 60 marks some years it is a goal it will goes to 65 okay so remember something you have to get between 55 to 65 marks to get into so this below 1000 rank okay so and if you try for 70 marks it will be more better okay so we have to plan according to that okay so in a different video we will see about all these so subject wise how many questions they are giving how much marks they are giving okay so about what our 2 t means okay see 2 t we provide online coaching all over india so for the gate and all other competitive exams also okay so what is our specialty means we will provide the high quality video classes okay so all however you are seeing the video now okay so it is the high quality video the same type okay so you will be seeing all the classes in high quality videos only okay and all our lecturers okay so they are not only experienced okay so they have completed their mtech and phds from the nits or iits okay so they are all experienced experienced and they are already qualified for so many exams and they have they have been working in so many organizations all over india okay so and see one more thing okay for each and every subject we are providing all the questions discussion okay so previous year question discussion because previous years is the only questions okay so you can get the standard of the questions so that's why we will provide all the previous year questions in the video only with the explanations we will give all these okay so and remember so whenever you are preparing online means there will be some doubts we will be getting okay it's not like you will get in the first time okay so if you get some doubt about any question and all immediately you can ask okay so, and we will be clearing through the simultaneous doubt clearing sessions okay and there is no watching limit if you want to prepare for communication so after 10 days you want to watch some video again okay you can watch there is no watching limit okay these are all our features in 2t2 okay so try to join as soon as possible because get exam is not a simple one okay so you have to spend at least six to eight months completely then only you can able to achieve and it is the very good post you will be getting in from the gate exam good iit also okay thank you so much so start your preparation okay